Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. My name is Wizzy. As you guys all know, today guys I'm bringing you guys some very exciting Black Ops 3 information to share with you guys, a bit of tips and tricks information for you guys today. So anyway guys, let's get into it. So you guys know there's a lot of score streaks within Black Ops 3. They're not as powerful as they were in Black Ops 2. No one near as powerful as they were in Black Ops 2. They still do get you a lot of kills, but not nearly as much as what they used to, such as the Dog Swarm. Also, the Escort Drone used to get you heaps of kills. But yeah, there is some score streaks that are similar. So I'm going to talk to you guys about the score streaks that can get you the most kills within Black Ops 3. So let's start off with the Wraith. The Wraith is probably one of the most annoying and just really, really good kills streaks at the end black ops 3 first of all it's so hard to shoot down because sometimes it goes invisible also takes two rockets to shoot down it takes a while to just shoot it with your gun it is also very powerful and you can put it on a certain location and it certainly does do the job and kills a lot of people in that location you're always in the kill feed with the wraith it's just a really good starting off streak now a lot of people will question why i don't put the hater next now the orbital v set or the hater uh which is a new name for it isn't as good within black ops 3 doesn't last as long or doesn't seem to last as long as it used to and because the maps are a little bit bigger it doesn't really take as much effect as the old VSAT used to. So this is why I put the wraps in and the wraps, they're like dogs but they're probably not as powerful as dogs because dogs in Black Ops 1 were really really good. Black Ops 2 though, eh, it depends on what map you're on, depends how good the dogs are going to do. But yeah, the wraps are a really good kill streak for just ground and it's really good because you got that ground and air combination with the wraith and the wraps you got the ground control where you're killing everyone on the ground and then the wraith anyone that's trying to run upstairs or anything is just going to get killed by the wraith especially in the sky it's very hard to um, hide from things in the sky and that's when the wraps are going to come in and just destroy people who are trying to hide inside so this is why it's a really good kill streak and usually this is what happens when people run a lot of kill streaks is they forget about themselves and they start losing gunfights because you've got all these streaks going around you now this is why i put on the gi unit because the gi unit is absolutely awesome it's basically like your mark not your master it's basically like your sidekick so you can get it to patrol mode which means it just goes away from you and shoots people uh like a normal person would like a normal person would be playing call of duty or of course you can set it to watch you so everything you look at the gi unit's going to look it's going to watch your back. It's just a really awesome kill streak. If you've got a lot going on around you and you're not really focusing on other things around you and winning gunfights because you've got so many kill streaks, the GI unit is an awesome one. But anyway, guys, I hope these score streaks have helped you out. They do, will, and will get you a lot of kills. They really, really do. Trust me, they do because I used them in a game and I got heaps of kills. So make sure you use these score streaks to really help you out. Make sure to go and watch my previous Black Ops 3 videos if you have missed them. Make sure to give this video a big thumbs thumbs up all your support on my videos help me out i appreciate everything you guys do make sure you stay tuned for the video tomorrow i think i will be bringing the bo3 campaign if not i will be bringing a russian class setup because you guys have been playing nuketown 2065 i've noticed a lot a lot of people have been in that playlist the chaos mosh bit um, play playlist so i'm actually going to bring you a russian class setup so, but until then guys i'll catch you guys in my next game